All right, we're packing up. There's Bella. On to our next location, which is a harvest host. So one night only, and it's called Legendary Alpacas of Texas. Love the confidence. Uh, and there we will wake up on Mother's Day morning. And uh, I think then we go to another harvest host. But we're kind of waiting to hear back from the Texas Homeschool Coalition <clears throat> to see if um, they have any booth space at their Houston area show because since everything shifted in our timeline, we could do that show. It's in like two weeks. So we haven't heard back from them yet, but if so, we're going south to Houston. And if not, we're heading west to West Texas and New Mexico. So kind of waiting on that um, to figure out which direction we're headed. But we're definitely leaving here today. That much we know. Ella, where are we? We are at the most awesome place on earth. <laughs> the uh, legendary alpaca alpacas. farm. But there's a lot of wildlife here. Check out this rooster. Looks like they were shorn not too long ago. Uh, one month. A month ago? Okay. So how long, how often can, can you shear? Once a year. Okay. Oh, wow. One fleece, okay. fleece crop a year. Everybody gets sheared. It's usually around April 1st for us. Okay. Aww. Do you guys do it or you bring someone in? We bring somebody in. I've got 50 on average. And they're like, is she going for the feed scoop? Oh, she is. Yeah, they all know what you're doing. Hey, 
everybody feed them. So what they do, because they don't have teeth teeth, mm -hmm. uh, when you feed a horse, you hold your hand flat because they've got teeth and can pick up your fingers, right? So alpacas, you make a cup because the feet is small, but they pick it up with their lips. So mm. see how different it is? Yeah. And their tongue. <laughs> the club says yes to me, please. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Galliano. Jolo. Paca Paca. <laughs> Aren't they cool? Do you want something? So once COVID hit, we started having to figure out every square foot of this place has to make money somehow. It costs yeah. me twenty thousand dollars a year just to feed these guys. Oh wow! So I either have to get out or adapt. Grab some more. These two came from farms that didn't handle them at all. Oh really? And so it's been a little bit of a challenge. I used him for a reading today. It's the first time he didn't spit on me when I took the girl out. He gets really mad when I it's a process. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Are you trying to drive me? Just wanted to get a little bit of a uh, race. Watch out, buddy. 